Hi internet, in this video I will be unboxing the Easy Count Mini Heat Press Machine. I'm not sure exactly what color this is. Uh, for those of you who don't know what this is, this is meant to help you press down prints to your t-shirts, your canvas bags, whatever is made out of fabric. Um, here are some examples. This is what the back looks like. I'm assuming this is the adhesive that needs to warm up under the mini heat press machine. So I'm gonna put these to the side for now. I've never owned anything like this before. I picked this up for around $15 USD. So let's go ahead and just take a look at the inside. So we are introduced with the manual here. Some samples, ooh, these are fun. Summer times, we are in autumn, coming close to the winter time, but I definitely have some ideas for these already. Um, okay, comes with a pouch, I'm assuming this is to protect your mini heat press for travel, etc. Sorry about the background noise. Patience is a virtue. I'm just gonna... Take this out. Okay, so it's kind of sturdy feeling and this is a really nice cord, it's quite thick. Very professional packaging. Going to toss this before my cat starts to chew on it. And you know what? I don't need to remove the wire because I'm not gonna be heat pressing anything in this video. I will definitely record a first look at this product in terms of uh, the functionality, etc but this is simply just an unboxing. So if you are interested in how this works, feel free to uh, subscribe or just return to my channel <laughs> at a later time. Um, I will be playing around with this on camera. I do like to test products out um, for the first time on camera because I like to document my progress, <laughs> not only for myself, but for my viewers. Um, I want to show you guys that anything is possible. Um, so, <laughs> so learning how to make my own t-shirts. Okay, so this is what it looks like. It has a, I don't know what, what kind of material this is, but that's where the heat comes from. I'm assuming there's an infrared light that comes out or that is shown when the item is plugged in. There's that logo for the Easy Count machine. Okay, so I'm assuming this is the temperature wheel. So it starts at one, ends at four, and there is an off option there as well. And it has a very sturdy silicone pad. This is to rest your machine when not in use. Very, very cute. Um, I don't intend on using this for larger prints. I do wanna play around with um, smaller things, maybe for the holidays, things like that. Um, I was watching a bunch of heat press videos and apparently the optimal temperature for a quality heat press uh, for, I think it's called DTF uh, transfers. I could be wrong, um, sorry if I am. But um, the optimal temperature is around 300, 315, something like that for a quality heat press. I know the Cricut also has a heat press. I don't know if I'll ever invest in a Cricut, but I think this is a really good starter piece before investing in a more expensive machine. So that was my unboxing for the Easy Count Mini Heat Press machine. I hope you enjoyed this video. Uh, if you enjoy unboxings, product reviews, or crafting videos, feel free to subscribe. I would love to have you as my audience and I'll see you later. Take care.